Hello. Hello, teacher. Hello. Did you hear me? Teacher. <laughs> Hello. ¿Sí me escuchan? Sí, y ayer me salí de clase, fijo. Can you, ¿Sí me escuchan, Liliana? Sí, le escucho. Sí, le escucho. sí okay. es que yo ayer estaba hasta las nueve veces, fijo, le digo. Oh, sí, sí. Sí, me mandaron una nota ahorita y les, y les informé que fíjese que estoy esperando bebé. Entonces, yo antier. Fui a una ultra, la ultra no estaba, mandaron por otra, a otra clínica privada, Rupe, creo que se llama aquí por la Don Bosco. Y ayer me hice unos exámenes, así que andaba cansadísima. Y ya les comenté, el teacher anterior, el teacher José, sí le había comentado eso, que entonces ayer ya no pude <ríe> seguir, teacher. It's okay, no problem. Thank you so much uh, for that information, uh, Liliana. Okay. Every, welcome everyone. Let me let me read the chat. Andres says I'm driving. Okay, it's okay, Andres. When you are right home, so you can um participate. Okay, let me share my screen. Now I guess you can see it. Okay. Yes, remember that when um you are not in the complete class, well, your attendance is, is always taken. Su asistencia es tomada, pero uh, los minutos aparecen menos. Ahí eh, le va a aparecer el conteo de minutos según la aplicación, de acuerdo al tiempo que usted esté conectado. Ok. <clears throat> Okay. Um today is Thursday, July the th 13th. This is the class number 8. Welcome everyone to this class. Let me continue. So the lesson objective for today will be talk about everyday activities, okay? We're going to continue talking about uh everyday activities using simple present. Okay? Um At the end of this class, you will be able to talk about, um, sorry, here's missing the verb. Yes, at the end of this class, you will be able to talk about tasks in your workplace, okay? Well, that is a topic that we, that we have been working this week. Okay, now I have this activity related to frequency adverbs. So I'm going to use this um, roulette when I, um, let me choose the ones that are here, okay? So you are going to tell me or you are going to tell us one sentence using the adverb. For example, if if uh, you had to do one with usually, you are going to do one sentence. It could be a positive, negative, or question, okay? Using this adverb, usually. For example, I usually drink a cup of coffee. So you're going to use the adverb uh, that according to this uh, wheel is the one that you're going to work, okay? Let me see. Who wants to be the first one? Volunteers? Okay. Volunteers. Good evening, me. Good evening, Hazel. Good evening, everyone. Uh, maybe I usually 
drive to my job. Okay, very good. Yes, that is that is good. Thank you so much. I will remove it. Okay, who who is next? Raise your hands. Okay, Robert. Okay, you said that you win you win a chocolate, Robert. Okay, you don't have to you don't have to uh complete the, the sentence. See. I complete with one okay. advert. Okay, let me select other one. Okay, with always. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Always. Okay. I always drink coffee every day. Okay. I always drink coffee. Drink okay. Coffee. Okay. Okay, good. It is not necessary to use every day because if you use every day, it's, do not use always. Do not use always. Uh huh. Okay. You can say, I drink coffee. Oh, I drink coffee every day. Right. But if you use. If you use uh always, so you can say, I always drink coffee. Okay, good. Okay. Now, Gilberto. Mm -hmm. Gilberto. Uh, okay. He... He is open to go cinema. He often goes to the cinema. Teacher. He he is open to go cinema. Mm, in this case, will be he often goes to the cinema. You don't need the verb to be, okay? Yes. Okay, good. Thank you so much. Who who will be next? Volunteers? Me the chair. Ah, early. <laughs> okay. Okay, Liliana, then Maurice and then Lady. Okay, Liliana. Liliana? Can you hear me? Me si me escuchan. Hello? Yes, teacher. Yes, yes teacher. I listen ah. to. Okay. Liliana? One with almost never. Sería... Almost never. Quiero ver. Uh, and go to the beach. <laughs> okay. I. I. Oh, I almost never. Uh, I almost, almost never. Go to the beach. Go to the beach. Yeah. Okay. Thanks. Good. Thank you. Okay. Now, Mauricio. I sometimes go to play football. Okay. Good. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay. Okay, now lady. <laughs> you win a joke word. Okay. Okay, let me it again okay lady one with never i never visit panama oh, okay i never 
I never have visited, have visited Panama. Nunca he visitado uh -huh. Panama. I never. No le entendí lo siguiente, Miss. Have visited. Have visited Panama. Mm -hmm. Okay. <clears throat> Good. Okay, who else? Volunteers? Another volunteer? One with hardly ever. Casi nunca. Mm -hmm. Me. Okay, Daniela? I hardly ever drink coffee. Okay, good. Thank you so much. Okay, very good. Good job here. So now we're going to read the sentences that we uh, that you wrote yesterday. Okay. Thank you so much, Gilberto. I can uh, let me see the the first one. I see Luis every day. Okay. So in this case, we are going to. We don't need the letter S. Every day. Okay. He usually run in the car. Mm. Okay. But in this case, uh, she usually drive very fast. His car. Okay. He sometimes okay. drives, sometimes drives. Remember to add the letter S because it's the third person. She sometimes person, yes. drives my car. Uh -huh. We never work on Sundays. Okay. Capital letter with because it's the day. I always call. I always call all my clients. Okay, good. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Uh, was very good. This one. Okay, let me see Mauricio's exercise. I always go to the to play basketball every weekend. Mm. Okay. Do not use capital letters if that is not needed. Okay, every weekend. Mm -mm -mm. <clears throat> So in this case, it's, it's so a little redundant because you are saying, I go to play uh, basketball every weekend. So it means that you go all, I mean, every weekend, but todos los fines de semana, right? Uh -huh. So in this case, we are we omit this one, this word. I'm sorry. And we use just all every weekend, okay? I go to play basketball every weekend, okay? My sister sometimes cleans, because I'm speaking, I'm speaking about my sister, the house. Be careful with the use of third person, okay? Ha. Uh -huh. At night, we usually go to the party. Mm -mm -mm. This will be at the end. We usually go to the party at night. Okay. Frequently. I frequently drink coffee. Okay, good. From time to time. Drink soda. 
Who drink a soda? Who drink a soda? She, he, I. Okay. You need to add the subject to the sentences, okay? And coffee is missing one letter, E. Okay. Okay, check it. Thank you for the ones that are still writing. Thank you. I really appreciate your participation. Okay, Robert says, I always get up early, okay? I often go to the cinema. I don't often eat fish. Do you do you sometimes read a book? Uh-huh, good. I do exercise twice a week. Very good, Robert. Okay, Maria Leticia says, I rarely worry about fitting in. I usually write emails on my phone. I never complicate myself with cooking. I never complicate myself with cooking. So in this case will be Just cooking is not necessary to add with. I often shop at the supermarket. I always drink coffee in the morning. Okay. Very good. Andres says, I always get up at five o'clock. Okay, remember, we always add a period at the end of the sentences. I often practice, is missing one letter, in the shouldn't range. I never eat fish. I hardly, hardly ever, is missing one letter, visit the clients at night. My clients at night. Hello, teacher. Good night. Good Hello. evening. Good evening. Sorry, tenía problemas con la cámara y el micrófono. Okay, no problem. Okay, teacher, I read. Really... Yes. Uh -huh. eh, pero cómo hacen para subir eh, las tareas ahí? Um, ya le explico. I rarely visit the security guard on the mountains. Okay, good. So what you need to do is click on this sign. Okay, en este, en este signo más, click. Aquí escribe su nombre. And mm -hmm. And here you write your sentences, here. And once that you are done with your sentences, you publish here. Okay? And then we're okay. going, then we're going to see here your message. Okay. Okay. Okay, good. Let me see Carlos Arsenio. It says, I always study after class. I usually walk to work. To work. Mm -hmm. Okay, remember the period, the end. I normally get good marks. Okay. Teacher, lo siento, eso lo hicieron ayer o ahora lo han mandado. Yesterday. Okay. Y en, en 
¿En qué? ¿Así un programa tiene para enviarlo? Mm, it is a link in the, in the chat that I sent yesterday. The last link that says Padlet. Okay. Thank El you. último link. Uh -huh. Okay. I, I sometimes think in the shower. Okay, good. Let me see. Very good. I usually drink coffee twice a day. Twice a day. It's okay. Remember when it's not necessary to use capital letter, avoid to use capital letter. I'm rarely late for work. Good. I occasionally play soccer on weekends. Very good. I normally make calls every day at the office. Okay. I like to go fishing occasionally. So this occasionally, where it will be located in the sentence? Here, right? After the subject. I occasionally like to go fishing. Or we can admit this. Podemos omitir eso. Y quedaría, I occasionally go fishing. Okay. Very good, Julio. Okay, Daniela, I work every day. Good. I always have beans for breakfast. Very good. I like beans too. I usually read books. Okay, I never drink wine. I always go to the gym. Very good. Daniela, you are fitness. Okay. Okay, very good. Let me see. And the new ones that I have, Katy, I always use sunscreen. Okay, that is good. Yeah, nowadays it's very necessary to use sunscreen every day. I usually do exercise. I re rarely wake up late. She often go to the beach. I never dance. Okay. Very good. Very good. Patty. Okay. Um Lady says, I usually visit my grandparents, okay? I rarely drink coffee. I normally drive to my work. I hardly, I hardly always, hardly ever will be here, go to the gym, okay? Lady, I hardly ever Si rara vez va. Pero si usted va todos los días, I always go. Okay. I never do karate. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. That's really good. Wilbur says, I always break fast. What is missing there? Eat or take, or have, is missing a verb. I always take breakfast early, okay? My daughter usually wake up uh, late. Is missing one adverb. My friend never leave me alone. Your dad is rarely cheerful, uh-huh. My wife almost never gets 
irritated. Wow, that is a good quality. That is a really good quality if you never get irritated. He's very patient. Okay, very good job. Thank you so much, the ones that have participated here. Okay, who is missing? The ones that are here that haven't participated. So you still can do it, okay? You still can do it and I will check. And if you see check, it's because it's already checked. It. If you don't have um, any mistake, I will be, you don't have this like attachment here. Okay, very good. I can see someone writing. It's okay, thank you. But we are going to continue. Just let me take the attendance first. Okay, Liliana, you are here. Juliana? Juliana, you are here too. Julia? Are you here? I can see you. Hazel? Present. Okay, thank you. Kathy? Present. Okay. Jose Andres is still driving. Okay. Um, lady? Present. Okay. Daniela Lisette. I can see you. Mauricio de Jesus. I can see you here too. Gilberto. Present teacher. Okay, Maria Leticia. Present teacher. Good. Rolando Danilo. Rolando. Present teacher. Thank you. Salvador Alberto. Present teacher, I come to home now. Okay. Uh, Cindy, oh, Roberto Carlos, sorry. Present teacher. Okay. Teacher, I present. Lo, me, a veces se me va el inter. Yes, uh, I see. Don't worry. I already take your attendance. Cindy. Present teacher. Okay, Carla y Betty. Okay, Carla. Uh, oh, you will be como oyente. Olvide cambiarlo, teacher. Oh, cámbielo, please. Okay. Um, William Boris. William. No, William here. Okay, uh, Silvia. Present teacher. Okay. Carlos Ernesto. Carlos is missing too. Wilber. Present teacher. Okay. Thank you so much. Just is missing William, Boris, and Carlos. Okay. Well, thank you so much, everyone, for being here. Okay. Um, we're going to continue with the presentation. Later on, we're going to check the, the new exercises, the new um, sentences that we have there. Okay. Teacher, Julio yes? Paz, present. Okay, Julio, yes. Uh, yes, I already took the attendance. Thank you. I, I saw you there. Okay. So I have questions about, about your job. What is an important strategy restaurants? Okay, we're talking about restaurants. Could it implement to get more clients? Think about that. And what are some successful restaurants you do that you know? Okay. If you have a imagine that you have a restaurant. Okay, thinking one strategy, one strategia, 
that you could implement to get more clients. Mm -hmm. Try to think. I think to give to good experience in the place. Good experience, okay, good, yes. Good experience in the place. Mm -hmm. And how you are going to do that, good experience? With a uh, better customer service. Better customer service, uh-huh. What else? Try to think. Someone else? Thank you, Salvador. Salvador, entonces usted ya no está como oyente, ¿verdad? Porro good, es... music. good music. <laughs> okay, good music. Okay, yes. And good, good prices. And good prices and, and good quality of Of the food. Of the food. <laughs> okay. A variety of um variety of food, right? Different menus. Variety. Good marketing. Good sure. marketing. Uh huh. Good yes. marketing. In Good marketing. social media and and maybe degustaciones how how i can say degustaciones um proof of taste let me okay uh-huh like a like a little uh proof right that they can give some clients in order that they can taste all the the kind of food that they have mm -hmm. tastings okay Okay, thank mm -hmm. you. What else? So maybe a good location, right? Good location. So if there is, if they are located in a good place, they will have more clients, right? But if they are far away from the city, uh, they are um, in a place that maybe there are no people working. So probably they don't, they won't have clients. Sí, yeah, teacher. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, but it is important uh, the, in, ¿cómo se dice esto? Pues, que sean los, uh, Employer, eh, serían employer friendly. Friendly employees? Yes. Okay, but that is uh, uh, in uh, customer service, uh huh? That is in, they're in, in good customer service. Yes. Mm -hmm. Do you know? Yes. I think so. Um, Price, cheap is good, quality of food, uh, different menu mm -hmm. is, is very good, but it's very important. Uh, always treat people well and make you feel at home because when the personal or the restaurant treat, treat well the clients, uh, this is a good service for the clients. Correct. Yes. If I go to a restaurant where they uh, have good uh, customer service, they have quality food, and also they have very good prices, so I I will go again, right? Because I because um the experience that I have previously so I will think okay I like it I will go back but if you go to a place and you receive a bad customer service uh no good food 
uh, that is very expensive. You said, mm -mm, no. So, so this is the only time that I that I come here, right? And then, um, the strategies that they should implement are the ones that we have been talking about, right? Probably these counts in, in one plate, right? Uh, uh, once a once a week, for example, for example, they can say, uh, el plato del día, right? So that that a specific food will have like a 10 or 15% of these counts. So that will be a, a good strategy too. So that means that they have to prepare a lot of uh, food, okay? With that kind of um, recipe, con esa receta, because they know that um, maybe all people would, will try that specific uh, recipe because they have a discount. Okay, uh, very good, very good comments, okay? Now, we're going to continue with this conversation. Who wants to participate? Raise your hands. Okay, Hazel, Mauricio, Julio, Maria, Wilbur, Robert, Lady, Cindy, Gilberto, Silvia, okay, very good. First will be Mauricio and Hazel. Go ahead. Okay, perfect. Mauricio, it is there Mr. Mout or Jennifer? Mr. Mout. Okay. Mr. Go ahead, Mauricio. Okay, okay. Um, oh, sorry, teacher, I have a problem. Okay. I am Mr. Mutt. Mm -hmm. Hello, Jennifer. How it is going? Just fine, Mr. Mott. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. Uh, that sounds good. Look, I am thinking about new marketing strategies and I want to know some things. Tell me, sir. How often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir. We never do. Thank Thanks. you. You're welcome. Okay, good job. Strategy. Okay, only that word. Strategy. Strategies, okay? In this Got case, because that is plural, strategies. Got it. Okay, very good. Mauricio and Hazel. Now, Julio and Maria Leticia. Who is me? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, okay. Yes. Uh, Mr. Mong. Yes. yes. Okay. Um, hello, Jennifer. How is it going? Just fine, Mr. Mott. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. That's so good. Look, I am thinking about uh, new marketing strategies, strategies, and I want to know something. Tell me, sir. How often uh, do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. 
Uh, do we ever get a promotional edit? No, sir. We never do. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Just this boy. Item. Item. Okay, item. Right. Item. Or you can say item, right? You can pronounce like R. Item. Thank you. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Now, Wilbur and Lady. Okay, lady. Uh, hello, Wilbur. Hel uh, hello, lady. Uh, hello, Jennifer. How is how is it going? Just fine, Mr. Mott. I am just checking the number of people who come in on a regular basis. That song, that song good. Look, I am thinking about new marketing strat strategy and I want to know some some things tell me sir how often do you we change the menu you know menu well we seldom change the menu however we are promoting a dessert every week mm -hmm. Wilbur? Creo que tiene problemas con el micrófono. Okay. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir. We never do. Okay. Well, thank you so much, lady. And Wilbur, I don't know what happens with his microphone, but uh, it seems that it that is not working properly. Okay, but no problem. Okay, Robert and Cindy now. Hello, Cindy, are you ready? Hello, I'm ready. Okay, hello, Jennifer, how's it going? Just fine, Mr. Mott. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. That's on good, look. I am thinking about new marketing strategies and I want to know some things. Let me see. How often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we give a promotional item? No, sir. We never do. Thanks. Okay. Thanks. Very good, Robert and Cindy. Promotional item, it could be maybe um, a candy, uh, sweet bread. Uh, I don't yes, know. Sir. Uh huh. Yeah. A dessert. A mini dessert, right? But that will be a promotional item. Okay. Very good. Liliana and Gilberto. Gilberto, you, do you want to participate, right? Yes. Okay, Liliana and Gilberto. Gilberto will be Mr. Mo. I really... Okay, hello. Hello, Jennifer. How is, how is it going? I'm fine, Mr. Mom. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. That song go. Look, I am thinking about the new marketing strategy, and I want to know something. Tell me, sir. How often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. From where we are promoted and served every week. Do we ever keep promotional eating? No, sir. We ever never do. Okay, very good. Thank you. Strategy. Okay, take note of that mm -hmm. word. Strategies, okay? Okay. 
areas that are weak. Yes, thank you so much. Okay. Okay, Andres, almost at home. Okay, very good. Thank you so much for your participation here. Do you have questions about this conversation? Mm -hmm. No questions? Okay, good. We're going to continue. I have another another uh, conversation here. Who wants to participate? The ones that, ne that didn't participate in the previous one. Mm -hmm. I want to participate in this reality. Okay, good. Andres and Silvia, okay, Andres and Silvia. Okay, teacher. So, uh, I don't know if you want to start or, or me. Me. I'm going to start. You, okay. Okay. Hi, Matthew. How, how is you going? Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody is there, is here today because of the traffic, you know? You are right. Look who has the early in the late fish for this coming weekend? For, um, for. Um. Ah, but, but According uh, <laughs> according to the uh, schedule, Mark. Schedule, okay. And Sophie, have the morning and afternoon shift, and Song and Kate have the evening evening shift. Okay. Thank you. Okay. 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 I don't know, but there is a noise. So I don't know if that is raining where you are, but I can hear a noise that was very annoying. Okay, according to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kate have the evening shift, okay? Mm -hmm. There are just two participations for each one. Okay, now Robert and Lady. Robert and Lady. Okay, are you ready, Lady? Yes, I am ready. Okay. Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shift for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark. According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift. And Tom and Kate have the evening shift. Okay. Yes, lady. Very good. Thank you so much. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Uh, Maria and Kathy now. Okay. Uh, Kathy, Ben or Matthew? Mm, ben. Hey, okay. Matthew. Hey, Matthew. How is it going? Very good, Ben. I am relieved that every day Everybody, everybody, is, Every, everybody is here today. Everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shift 
for this coming weekend? According to this should Mark and Sophia. Should. Mark and Sophia have the morning and afternoon shift and Tom and Kate have the evening shift. Okay. Okay, good. Do you know what is relief? I'm relieved that everybody is here today. Do you know what is that? Relieved. Relieved. Mm -hmm. Relieved. Do you know what is that? Relieve. It is like happy, okay? I'm happy that everybody is here today. Okay? Similar, happy. Uh, similar, yes. Okay, if it's difficult for you to pronounce... Schedule. 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 Yeah, try to repeat. Repeat. Uh, um and you will be able to pronounce correctly, okay? According to the schedule. Mm -hmm. the schedule. Okay, who else wants to participate? Julio, what, and who else? Me, teacher. Okay. Julio and Mauricio, or Salvador. Hello. Uh -huh. Julio and Mauricio and Salvador, right? The three of you. Okay, now will be Julio and Salvador, and then uh, Mauricio, if you want to participate. Okay, okay. Julio and Salvador, go ahead. Okay, uh, who begin? I begin. Okay. Hey Matthew, how is it going? A very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know? You're right. Look, who has the early in late shift for the coming weekend? Uh, according to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon. Chief and uh, Tom and Kate have the evening chief. Okay. okay. Very good. The evening chief. Okay. Thank you so much. Teacher, teacher, teacher. Um, la forma correcta de pronunciarlo es evening o es evening? Evening. Okay. Y tengo mucha duda porque igual lo pronunciábamos anteriormente con el docente anterior como evening o evening. ¿Really? Yeah. Uh, de hecho, en algunos eh, que podcasts o cuestiones así lo he visto como evening. Uh, evening, como que iba una F. Evening. Evening. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Evening. Evening. Okay. Normally we said even evening, right? Evening. Okay. Yes, but yeah, it is correct. If Thank evening, you. evening too. Okay, good. Thank good you. observation. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Okay. Very good. Who else wants to participate? Gilberto, okay, Gilberto and Mauricio now. Mauricio. Okay. Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look who had the early and late shifts. For the coming weekend. Mm -hmm. 
Mauricio. Okay. According to the to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kate have the evening shift. Okay. Good. But there is one word that we need to repeat the pronunciation, okay? Schedule. 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 Yeah. Schedule. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Evening. Evening. Okay. If, if, then. Evening. Evening. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we're we're going to try to try uh, to pronounce in this way. Evening. If you listen carefully, it sounds like a it has the evening like the e. Okay. Evening. Mm -hmm. Evening. But you are right when you said that it is evening. If you pronounce like, uh Trying to identify the sounds. Yes. Evening. Evening. Okay, very good. Thank you so much for that observation. Okay, uh, now I have some questions for you. Okay, what kind of restaurant do you think Jennifer manage? Jennifer is a manager, right? What kind of restaurant do you think that Jennifer manage? That was the previous, um, this one, the previous conversation. Uh -huh. What kind of restaurant will be? Mm -hmm. Menu, dessert, dessert. Mm -hmm. Okay. Maybe a dessert where it, they sell a lot of uh, like uh, desserts, right? What are some marketing strategies the restaurant is using nowadays to get more clients? Do you remember? What are the marketing uh, strategies? Uh -huh. They are changing the menu often, right? They often change the menu. What else? And promotion of the search. Yes, there every week. Every week. Mm -hmm. every week. Okay. The they, they promote a dessert. Okay, very good. And probably they are going to provide a promotional item to the customers, right? Because it is um it is one question that um the owner, maybe this he is the owner. It is one question that he has. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir, we never do. So it means that probably will be another strategy. Okay, good. So continuing with this, we're going to continue with the topic of average of frequency. So yesterday we were discussing about uh, how to use them. Okay, for the ones that didn't receive or didn't attend the class yesterday. So one explanation will be that the adverb will be before the main verb. In this case, for example, often is before change. Change is the main verb in the sentences. And the example says we often change the menu. Okay. We always give away a promotional item okay and the same is before the the main birth they regularly select the new options the same right okay what else do you remember one example with the bird to be who remember one example with the bird to be when a bird to be is included Uh huh. Remember me? One example. They mm -hmm. are. Okay, lady is. 
always. Mm -hmm. Early at work. Okay, this is one example with the bird, using the bird to be. So the adverb will be after the the bird to be before the adjective, right? What else do you remember? In one, uh, if we create one question using the same information, does lady always early at work? Or in this case, because we're using the verb to be is lady. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Always early at work. Okay. Okay. Good. Do you have questions about this, someone? Teacher, I have a question. In first sentence, uh, early uh, at is or no? I'm sorry? In first in is is person 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 early? No, because this is not a verb. It is a not a verb. No, this is an adjective. It doesn't apply the rule to add the letter S. All right. Mm -hmm. When we have a main verb, in that case, yes. Let me let me. Create what example? What example? Mm -mm -mm. Okay, the examples that we have here, okay? Lady. Mm -mm. Always. Start. Starts working at seven AM. Okay, in that case, yes. We're going to add okay. the letter S. Because it is a positive sentence. And we are using third person, okay? Okay. Teacher. Yes. En este caso, los adverbios de frecuencia no actúan como un auxiliar, como en el das o cuando usamos modal, modal verb, sino que siempre hay que usar la es o es en tercera persona cuando usamos adverbios de frecuencia. Mm. Dígame un ejemplo y lo aplicamos. Ah, por ejemplo, cuando usamos das, ya el verbo no, lo, no le ponemos ese porque está, estamos usando un auxiliar. Correcto. Cuando usamos un, un modal verb, por ejemplo, should, he should, do your homework, él debería hacer su tarea, no usamos en el verbo S o ES porque el modal verbo nos sirve como para no usarlo. 
lo contrario en el adverbio de frecuencia, que sí hay que usar S en la tercera persona. Correcto, pero depende. Si, en este caso, si es una pregunta... La S de la tercera persona, ya no. ¿Por qué? Ah, porque we are, you, you, we are using the auxiliary here. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay, thanks for the example. Okay. When is a third, uh, when we use uh, third person, is a positive sentence, okay? No ha sido afectada por ningún otro auxiliar acá. After always, sí. We're going to apply the rule with the S, E, S, or I, E, S. Okay? Very good. Uh, thank you so much. If you don't have more questions about this, we're going to continue. Okay, write sentences about the activities you do at workplace. Use the following adverbs of frequency to state how often do you do these activities. Okay. So try to write one sentence with each adverb that uh, activities that you normally do at work, okay? For example, always, one activity that I always do. I, I, I always, always get up. Check my uh, email. Mm, activities that you do at, at work, okay? Not in your house, at work. Okay. My email. Mm -hmm. I always check my emails. Uh -huh. One with rarely. I. I rarely, rarely mm -hmm. buy food near to my job. <coughs> near to my job. near to my job oh my work yeah mm -hmm. so you uh you have your own lunch you cook and you Am have I your own lunch, lunch? or you yeah. go oh. Always or, or sometimes I uh, take my breakfast in my house. Okay, good. Okay, one with hardly ever. I hardly ever. Mm -hmm. One example. Bring a coffee. Make coffee. Or <laughs> drink coffee or make coffee. Drink coffee. Drink you coffee. Like <laughs> At work. Okay. Mm -hmm. Get off early. Mm. Remember uh -huh. activities, activities. I seldom arrive late. Uh -huh. 
Y como para salir temprano, o sea, como rara vez salir temprano, ¿cómo se podría decir? Leave. Leave. Oh, ok. Ok, for, it could be a one. I never leave. Early. My job. Uh -huh. Casi, ok, nunca se va temprano. Ok. What with sometimes? I sometimes play um, video games with my daughter. Mm, remember that are activities at your workplace, not your house. Okay. It's my work. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Go out, maybe go out. Sometimes at work. <laughs> go out with. Sometimes go out to eat with my co workers. I sometimes go out to eat with my co workers. Mm -hmm. Okay, examples. Someone else that had, had a different example? Mm -hmm. Different example? Teacher. Okay. I never eat fish when I go to the beach. <laughs> okay. Or in your like job. It. Oh, in your job, right? I well, I you like never fish. fish <laughs> I li I like fish, but I never eat fish if in my job. Mm -hmm. oh. Okay, very good. Someone else? Another example? No? Okay, no problem. So we're going to do more examples later. Okay. Okay, here we have exercises. Okay, here we're going to write the, the correct sentences. Mm. Okay, he often listens to the radio. Radio. Mm -hmm. Okay, he often he often listens Termina. to the radio. Okay, good. Number two. They sometimes, sometimes read a book. Read a book. Read a book. Okay. Pete never get Pete. angry. Pete. Never Pete. get angry. Never get angry. Angry. Okay. Tom. 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 Usually is very friendly. Very friendly. He is usually very friendly. Friendly. Okay, remember the use of verb be. Before the, before the adverb. Mm -hmm. Number five. I sometimes sugar in my coffee. They sugar in my coffee. I don't like it with sugar. I never take sugar in my coffee. Coffee. 
Okay. Ramon and Ramon Frank are often angry. Are often angry. Good. My grandmother always, always does does for a wall in the evening. 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 Does for for a walk walk in the evening the evening the evening <sighs> evening okay Walter usually Walter usually help his father father in the kitchen. In the kitchen. Okay, number 10. Number they nine, never, never watch TV in the afternoon. afternoon. Never watch TV in the afternoon. Mm -hmm. Good. Christine, Christine never, never, never smokes. smokes. Never. Smokes. Okay, very good. Okay, we check. Okay, we got a hundred. Okay, all of them are correct. Very good. Good job, good job here. Do you have questions? No question, teacher. Okay. Good. Very easy to use adverbs of frequency. If you if you realize, if you apply the rules, uh, will be very clear to use them. Okay. Okay. Good exercise. Okay. Look at the graph showing how often three branches of a restaurant do promotional activities during a month. Okay. Then as a classmate, how often each branch does pro promotional activities? Write your classmate answer in the chart below. Mm, this is like an example, but it's very easy to identify the percentage here, right? We have here like a changed menu, rotate shift, new desserts, uh, promotional item. San Salvador, La Paz, La Union, and Usulutan, like a different branches that we have here. So in this case, we're going to apply this scenario or this um, kind of information in a different activity, what you are going to do. This is just an example, look at this. Uh, look at the schedule at the restaurant and answer the following questions. Who managed the restaurant, who cooked? Okay, we have here the different positions. We have a cashier, cook, manager, order, take care, and a waiter. And we have here different names. Okay, so in your company, in the place where you work, so do you have like a different positions? What kind of positions or how many positions do you have in your company? Try to think about that. And we are going to create a conversation with you, one of your classmates, okay? Talking about the positions that you have in your company. So you are going to create a conversation about schedules in your company and what are the different positions that you have, okay? For example, different schedules. It could be the one schedule is, is uh, between or from 7 a.m. To, to 3 p.m. or 4 p.m. And the other schedule is between 12, 12, right? Uh, and the, to 10 p.m. I don't know, different schedules that you, that you know that your company have and the different positions. Who wants to tell me an example? 
For example, uh -huh. Robert, I don't know, lady, tell me about one of the, what are the different positions that you have in your company? Okay, teacher, in my company, they are, there are different positions, for example, mm -hmm. a manager, mm -hmm. um, supervisor, mm -hmm. manager of human resource department, department, mm -hmm. department. Mm -hmm. Um, manager for ET department, manager of mechanic, 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 mm -hmm. and the there is a manager of quality control department. Mm -hmm. And there is a manager of of department of accounting. Okay. And others. And others. Okay, good. Good yeah. example. Yes, lady. A country principal. Como directora país. I'm sorry. Country principal, directora país. No sé si se dice así. En Spanish, how do you say that? La posición. Directora país. Directora país. país. Uh -huh. And where do you work, you said, uh, lady? Uh, es una organización que se llama Contextos que trabaja en formaciones, está orientado para docentes, para directores. Eh, también trabajamos con estudiantes, con alcaldías, en un proyecto que fortalece literacidad, razonamiento lógico-matemático, gestión escolar, liderazgo. Uh -huh. Entonces ajá, presentamos al Ministerio de Educación planes formativos y ya cuando están aprobados, capacitamos a, a estos actores que les estaba mencionando. Okay. Entonces tenemos un director a país, coordinador de proyectos, formadores docentes. Yes, she is the principal of the uh, organization, right? So, but um, to have like a translation, Directora mm -hmm. País, that is the name in Spanish, uh, but it will be like a principal of the organization. We're going to call it like that. <clears throat> She's the principal of the your organization, okay? Mm -hmm. Of, okay. Um, okay. Those are the examples. And what about the schedule? What are the different schedules that they have? <laughs> so your company, for example, what uh, what are the schedules that they um in the company is open from Monday to Friday? Uh huh. Between seven. between seven. seven Seven thirty at four p.m. Okay, four p.m. So from seven a.m. to four p.m. Uh, from Monday to Friday. Monday to Friday, yes. Okay, that means that everybody has the same schedule, right? Yes. Yep. Everybody in the company, everybody Sorry. in the organization. Okay. So that is your case, but maybe there are some cases different, right? Different cases. So that is the conversation that you're going to create. You are going to talk about the different positions that you have in your company and also like a different schedules, different positions that you can apply. Okay. Uh, let me create the rooms. I will give you 10 minutes. 
know that you can work on that conversation, creating that conversation, talking about um, that specific information that you have. Okay, we are now 18. Somos 18. Creo que todos estamos available to participate. So it means that I will create um, nine groups. Okay, Andres, you will go to room number one and Cindy. Okay. Okay, Daniela and Gilberto to room number two. Juliana. Okay. okay. Juliana, uh, are you there? Okay, Hazel and Julio, room number three. Okay. <clears throat> Carla, Ivari, and Kathy, room number four. Lady and uh, okay. Robert, no, room number five. Number six. Maria Leticia and Silvia. Okay. Seven, Mauricio and Rolando. Hey, chair. Yes? Me, room number five with Will. Number five with Lady. Lady, thanks. Mm -hmm. Okay, and number nine will be Oh, number eight, Salvador and Wilbur. And number 10. Uh, Juliana, are you there? Just to make sure. Hello. Okay, so if we don't have someone else, Liliana is missing. I'm going to add her in another group. Okay. Voy a agregar a Liliana in group number one. Okay. So we'll open the rooms now. <clears throat> Daniela, are you there? Daniela. Sorry, teacher, que se me había trabado el teléfono. Mm, okay, you can move to room number two. Juliana Maria, are you there? Juliana Maria? Lo que usted, las actividades que usted hace en su trabajo. Por, por ejemplo, uh -huh. para comenzar, por ejemplo, yo, I start my job at 7 o'clock. Later, between 7 to 8. 
eh, ahí pongo una actividad, ¿verdad? Ahí se pone. And then, este, between. Si yo le digo. Yo le voy a decir, por lo menos en my case, in the company, eh, I mean, eh, con my boss. Una, entonces... Teacher. Hello. ¿En qué consiste la actividad? Ok. Uh, it is a conversation talking about your company, ok? About the different mm -hmm. positions that your company has, mm -hmm. ok? Different positions, for example. That is one example, right? So, in, the, in a restaurant, there is a uh, Manager, order taker, waiter, someone who cook, like a shear. So that are the different positions. And also, uh, where are the different schedules that you have? Mm -hmm. But if your company is no a restaurant, so you can talk about the specific um, posi positions that you have in your company, right? We, we can take the position of the organigramma. Yes, um, like an example. Mm -hmm. But if if you if you have a different position in your company, try to to do it related to to your company. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Good. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Todo okay, so, Julio. Okay. Eh... Los escribimos. Escribimos la posición. Exacto, exacto. exacto. Muy bien. Por ejemplo, yo creo que podemos coincidir con que me imagino que donde usted trabaja hay una. Okay. En Uranswer, right? Sí. Okay. Thank you. Yes. Um... Ahí creo que podría entrar la pregunta. Eh... In your company, <laughs> what does the company do? Y yo digo, uh, o podría ser, um, where are you work? Mm -hmm. Entonces pues yo puedo decir, I'm work to Paez, El Salvador. Mm -hmm. Ice. Pues cuando yo digo I am work to ice, um, ahí podrían, podríamos hacer la pregunta del horario, ¿verdad? Sí. Ok. Um, what special? What special of the company? What is the special of the company? What is the is special? Of the company. Esa pregunta me la haría usted, ¿verdad? Mm, yo creo que la haría usted, 
Yo respondo, luego yo pregunto lo mismo. Um, what is the schedule of the company? ¿Qué podría decir? Um, de, ¿Cómo es área? ¿Cómo el, el área? ¿Cómo, cómo sería? De, ¿De qué? ¿Área? El área X o el o administración. Oh, podría ser de administration. <ríe> Yo le he puesto así. Este, train teacher, que serían como los formadores docentes. Ok, eh, ok. Coordinator project es el coordinador, el que da el rind de cuentas a, a estos financiadores internacionales. Es como el CEO. Como el, la directora de país viene siendo como, la, como el CEO de país. Entonces, Ajá. Proyectos le rinde cuenta a ella. Exacto. Y ella rinde cuenta, es como cadenitas. A Chicago. Ajá. Pero oh. Chicago es otra sede. Y, por ejemplo, quien financia el proyecto de acá es de Suiza. Entonces, como la, okay. la cadena que va así. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Do, you, ¿Do you want to travel Suiza o Chicago? Ay. Sí, yes. <laughs> I need to uh, speak English. No, I, you, you speak English. You, you are speaking English. You are right English. You, you are listening English. We are in the process. You can do it. Thank you. <laughs> Nada más, vean. Yes, only. A saber qué más, qué más, qué es lo que... Lo que quiero ver... Es que en cashier y customer service, la misma persona lo... Ah, ejecuta el trabajo. Uh -huh. De acuerdo. Teacher. Hello. Consulta, eh, the helpers is correct o sería assist, assistant de mechanic, porque es un asistente eh, del área de mecánica. Mechanic assistants. Ah, mechanic assistant. Uh -huh. Employer, content, secretary, vigilant, crosser, eh, vigilante o oh, bodeguero teacher es crosser. Security guard is, is el vigilante. Ah. Security guard. Security. Card, como vehículo, guard. Guard, no, guardia. Ah. Uh -huh. Guardia de seguridad sería. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Security guard. Ok, la bodega es como un warehouse, ok. Entonces el bodeguero sería el warehouse man. Warehouse man. man. Ok. Ok. Finish teacher. Ok, thank you so much. Ok. Uh, Two minutes more and then we are back. Uh -huh. Teacher, solo íbamos a sacar el listado de, de eso o íbamos a hacer graf, gráfica o algo más. No, at least, okay. You are going to speak about the schedule, different schedules that you have in your company. Oh, diferentes okay. horarios de los trabajadores. 
Oh. And what are the different positions? But try to make a conversation. Try to like uh, ask, uh, okay, where do you work? Okay, I work in, in you said the name of the, the company, right? Mm -hmm. And you can ask, um, how many positions do you have in your company? Or how many people uh, work in your company? So, and the other person can start speaking, oh, we have a mechanic assistants we have a warehouse man we have a manager okay all the positions that you have okay and they were and we work for example from 7 a.m to 8 p.m we have different schedules uh you can mention the schedule that you have and the other schedules available okay mm -hmm. Okay, okay, see you in one or two minutes, okay? Okay, thanks. Thank you. A schedule, dijo, ¿verdad? Scheduled. 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 Ah, yeah. Mm -hmm. The department customer, digamos. Uh, sí. sales, sales, sales department, igual. Eh, eh, por el tema de marketing eh. <risa> all, all function <risa> of you es cierto sí, sí. sería como the maintenance department ah, podría sí, ser verdad. algo así tendría que ser verdad Creo que sí. Por ahí tendría que ser. Main, main, maintenance. Maintenance department. Department. Porque, ajá, ajá. porque sería ajá, de departamento de mantenimiento, ¿verdad? De mantenimiento. Ajá, ajá. Exacto. Ok. Si hay una, por ejemplo, guardia de seguridad. Tendría que ser un security guard. Bear. Ajá. Para el caso. ¿Y si tiene área de bodega la empresa? Es warehouse, ¿verdad? Ajá. Warehouse, vea. Ajá, Antes warehouse. Ajá, warehouse. Ajá, la bodega, warehouse. Ajá, warehouse, sí, bodega, ajá, cabal. Uh -huh. Warehouse. Ok, ok, sí. Excelente, warehouse. Bodega. Eh, ajá. Ajá. Sí. Entonces, a lo mejor lo podemos manejar así por más o menos el estándar, creo que es. Eight. Eight, eight, eight. Uh, to 4 p.m. and maybe we can say the the lunch time to 12 um 1 p.m. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, thank you. Es, es la variante. Va, es perfecto. Uh -huh. Nosotros nosotros en su momento tuvimos algo así, bueno, que depende de, de quién esté en la administración, pero de momento uh -huh. sí Sí, estamos con el descanso de 12 a, a 1. Uh -huh. Y sí, en el horario de, de 8 a, a 4. Sí, nosotros sí estamos hasta las 6 porque no trabajamos los sábados. Bueno, perfecto. Yo creo que todos están saliendo. Sí, sí exacto. Gracias, estamos. Isa. Gracias, Julio. Welcome, everyone. Okay, very good. Are you ready? Yes or not? Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. 
Okay, good. Okay, good. Thank you. We have here the different rooms. Okay. We are going to finish. Okay, good. Here I have um well let me share my screen again. Okay, I have a wheel. So this wheel will decide which rune will be the first one. Okay. We have uh, mm -hmm, we have almost 15 minutes. Well, because we had to work on, on the activity number eight, we're going to work 12 minutes in this activity. And the rest will continue tomorrow. Okay. I see who will be the first one. Okay, room number six, where is Maria Leticia and Silvia Estela? Yes, teacher. Okay. In the in the different position in my work is a pardon teacher yes I'm here actually in the different position in the company is taller small truck mm -hmm. Is the employer, content, secretary, security, what? A warehouse, warehouse mates? Warehouse a, man? Ah, perdón. Warehouse man. Mm -hmm. a, the other is sales manager, consumer service, mechanic, is a mechanic assistant. Mechanic, 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 assistant. mechanic assistant. Okay. Uh -huh. The employer shall be in the review in the workplace in the 6 a.m. o'clock. Okay, the schedules. A schedule? Mm -hmm. From 6 a.m.? A yes. Uh huh. Two? The the other, the content sheldon, uh, the review in the workplace in the 7 a.m. o'clock. Okay, but what is the schedule that you usually, uh, well, that you normally have? All uh, right, schedule 7 a.m. From 7 a.m. to? Mm -hmm. The content. Uh, the secretary, the secretary uh, shall down in the 70, uh, 30 a.m. In the security ward is, is the Sheldon uh, 8 p.m. o'clock. Okay, but tell me the complete schedule that you that they have from it. For example, your schedule. Tell me your schedule from seven a.m. to eight to eight. eight. Oh, from eight. eight. No, from eight, eight a.m. Uh huh. Uh -huh. P.M. 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 This guard is the security guard in the nocturne okay so they have an schedule from 8 a.m to 8 p.m uh-huh yes from 8 a.m to 8 p.m so it means 12 hours from, uh 4 a.m p.m from 8 to 4 p.m from 8 a.m to 4 p.m to from p.m mm -hmm. Okay, okay, Bye. from, from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. Ah, uh, okay. The, 
The security guard security, shell. Security guard. Security guard from uh, Sheldon from 8 p.m. to from. To 4 p.m. To 4 p.m. Okay, repeat this. Schedule. A schedule. 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 Okay, a schedule. A schedule. Okay, so so. Get okay, scheduled. A schedule. Okay. Schedule. Okay, good. So, thank you so much. And, okay, so thank you so much. Silvia and Maria Leticia, what do you have? Okay. <clears throat> the different position in my job mm -hmm. at the doctor is the boss, cashier, customer service, watchman and cleaning staff. We all arrive at work at 8 a.m. and leave at 5 p.m. Okay, the same as schedule for everyone. Oh. Do you have the same as schedule, right? Everyone uh, enters at 7, you said? 7 a.m.? 8 a.m. 7.30 a.m. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. To 5 p.m. To five oh. p.m. Okay. Uh, me faltó. <laughs> mm -hmm. What else you had to say? Mm. Eh, solo eso hice. Only that. Yes. Okay. Accountant. Accountant. Okay. If you have okay. that position. Uh, Sylvia, you mentioned that. And also you mentioned the security, gu security guard. Okay. Sales manager and mechanic assistants. Right. Okay. Good job. So. It is like a conversation, but if you didn't uh, design or create a conversation, it's okay. You can just, just you can say uh, the information like Sylvia and Marie. Okay. Well, thank you so much. Okay. Thanks. Okay. Try to repeat that word. Okay. The schedule, because that is difficult. I can see. Schedule. Okay. Schedule. 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 Scheduled. Scheduled. Okay, good. Number two, Daniela and Gilberto. Okay, teacher. Mm -hmm. In my case, in the company Global Import Spy, starting seven o'clock. Uh, Meaning seven o'clock, uh, hasta como puede decir hasta las ocho a.m. Okay, I start for at work at seven a.m. o'clock. Huh? I finished. I finished at. A, at finish uh, eight o'clock. At 8 p.m. o'clock? Sí, 8 p.m. o'clock. Then, uh, I mean, uh, with my boss, the department, the, the salesman, the uh, uh, area, the, the Meaning uh, private, uh, uh, 
department, the, the coins, no, verific the factories. El departamento de contabilidad nos verifica las facturas, de verdad, el pago. ¿eh? Ok, account, account department. Okay. Account department. Verific. They, they verify. Verify. Uh -huh. The bills. The bills. The, the client, ¿verdad? The bills clients, uh -huh. Yeah. Oh, the client's bills, I'm sorry. The client's bills. The mm -hmm. client's bills. Uh, other department, uh, <clears throat> service client, uh, area de, de despacho, yeah, um, y, y, y department de security. Security. Mm -hmm. Only teacher, only that. Okay, you said service department. Do you mean customer service department? Yes. Department the custom, the customer department. service department, right? Yes. Okay, so when you said despacho, it's el despacho contable, right? Yes. Okay, that will be the accountant, accountant firm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Accountant firm. Accountant firm. Okay. Firm. Okay. Okay. Thank you so much. What about you? see Daniela okay in my company the hours are uh, by extend they are from 7 to 40 30 and on Fridays I live I live at 3 30. Um, I work in the sewing department. Okay. Um, what are the different positions that you have in your company? I start with the manager production manager, production manager, production engineers, mm -hmm. supervisor of the supervisors. Mm -hmm. Supervisors, trainers, quality, and operators. Trainers. Mm -hmm. Okay. Quality mm -hmm. and operators. Okay, good. And what are the schedules that are available in your company? Um, Todos salen a la misma hora? Everybody had the same schedule? Oh, um, como se dice todos salen a la misma hora. Yeah, everybody leaves the company at the same time. Okay. Okay, thank you so much, Daniela. So room six and room two. Okay, you are done today. So we are missing for tomorrow, room one, three, four, five, seven, and eight. So we're going to continue tomorrow talking about that. Remember, uh, you can uh, create a conversation. You still have time to prepare if you haven't created. Or you can also just provide the information like they did it today. Good. Let me see. Um, we're going to continue with the activity, the one that we are missing. Okay. That which activity is? You remember? The homework number eight. Okay. Hey. Go to the platform. And 
and go to the homework number eight. Okay. Number one will be Jeff work or works from 6 a.m. to 4 p.m. Works. Works. Okay. Janet Pete cleans or clean the tables every day. Mm. Cleans, right? Okay. Mm. I, don't, I don't know if I I'm sharing I'm sharing my screen or not. Sorry. I'm sharing my screen or not? No. Not no. no. Okay, sorry about that. Let me do it now. Okay, up here. Now? Yes. 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 <clears throat> okay, we are here. Number two. Number three. Mark, don't take or doesn't take orders on, on Wednesday. Doesn't take orders on Wednesdays doesn't take okay a restaurant opens or open from 9 a.m to 10 p.m opens opens okay number five our boss spends or spend much time in the restaurant spends spends okay <clears throat> good good job there you have it oh no i'm sorry here is clean because we're clean. about two two people. I'm sorry. We have two. Jen and Pete. Sorry about that. Okay. There you have it. Thank you so much for the ones that are doing the activities at the same time. Do you have questions, guys, before we go? No? Okay, no. so that will be everything for today. Remember for tomorrow, the, the rooms or couples that are available, that will be the first activity after the, the warm up. That will be the first activity, okay? Thank you so much for being here. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Bye, Bye. teacher. Bye, Bye. Good night. Good night. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. See you. Bye. Bye. Bye, Bye